unintended consequences after an Upper East Side building put up some netting. But CBS 2's Nick Calloway reports. Animal advocate Peel Horbelt has been scouring the underside of this sidewalk shed, looking for and unfortunately finding pigeons. They're not c c completely sealing the holes, so there's gaps and the, the birds are getting in. They're making nests up here and the babies get caught. The netting was put up under the sidewalk shed at the Normandy Court apartment building on East 95th Street and 2nd Avenue. It's meant to prevent the pigeons from dropping you know what on the sidewalk and people below. But in recent weeks, animal rescuers and even residents of the building say they regularly see dead and trapped birds. I'm upset by it. it it's killing innocent animals. Animal advocates have successfully rescued several baby pigeons from the nets. At least two of them were taken to the Wild Bird Fund, a wildlife rehabilitation center, including this three-week-old now named Beechnut. One day, Beechnut will be released back to the wild. Rita McMahon is director of the Wild Bird Fund. Well, it was an unthinking situation. Yes, you want to have the pigeons leave this area, but you don't trap them to starve, to die of dehydration. After we asked the Department of Buildings if the netting was up to code, a DOB inspector went to Normandy Court and found that the approved plans for the sidewalk shed did not include the netting that was installed. DOB will be issuing violations to the building's management company, Ogden Cap Properties. Animal rescuers I talked to say they would like to collaborate with the building's contractors to safely get all the birds out before putting netting back up, hopefully with fewer gaps. On the Upper East Side, Nick Calloway, CBS 2 News. Now, a rep representative for Normandy Court Apartments told CBS 2 that before the netting went up, the pigeon problem was so bad that they were cited by the Department of Health. Officials with the apartment building say that they are now working towards a resolution.